Hi guys, ah, I'm back from Bali. Oh my goodness, it was amazing. The only thing was bad was not enough time. I want to be there longer. Like I want to be there. I my goal is to one time go to Bali for a month. Like I've seen like YouTubers do this before. And that's like my ultimate goal is one time like be there for a month because there's so many things to do and see in Bali. Like a week was not enough, but we made the most of it. We definitely seen so many beautiful places. I just can't believe till now that I was there. Like I still can't believe I went to Maldives and I still can't believe I went to Bora Bora. Like my husband's awesome. Like he's amazing, you know, doing all this stuff, like all these amazing dreams of mine like he just he's, he's amazing and that's my goal definitely to one day um be able to retire him that would be my dream if i could like you know um what do you have i have everything but the glass shelves if you were trying to take it away this is exciting about two hundred dollars to put it together. Yay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is some part of the growers that they put that. See. So instead of asking my husband for a purse. This year, I asked him for the rest of my closet that needs to be finished. Ikea, it was so easy. The guy had experience. It's not like he doesn't do this every day. So he helped me out a lot. I had no idea what I was doing. Like I went in there not knowing and the guy just completely helped me out. It was amazing. I think it was 50 bucks for delivery and 200 for them to put it together. But it's definitely worth it because, yeah, like it was, we were gonna have to bring the truck out and that would have been a lot of work. And so we just paid for it. And it's, look at that. Imagine we having to deliver, well, pick up and then drop it off. So it's worth it. And if, God forbid, I scratch my husband's truck and our truck is like this one. Okay, it's not here, but. Yeah, I should go. So they're done and this is everything but i'm missing three clear see-through shelves or i think it's two or three because it was out of stock so it's gonna get delivered tomorrow and then i'm gonna go pick it up because i'm not gonna pay another 50 bucks for two things so i'm gonna wait i'm gonna have to go get it tomorrow when they call me that it's ready oh the guy are you kidding me I didn't know the guy actually added these. Like, I didn't say I wanted these. I mean, I was going to get one, but not freaking four. Because this, what is this even for? Like, sunglasses? I guess the guy added these, which is good. Because I guess with the price that we paid, it was included these. So, because this is not the strongest. Obviously, IKEA is not, you know, like. But, if you don't move it around, it will last you just can't take it out and then move to a different house. Like like expensive closets, like Closet California or whatever, you can move it around back and forth. But this, you have to leave it forever. Like if you take it out, it breaks. So that's how it works with IKEA closets or whatever these are called. So I was very scared. I'm like, well, I don't know. Like I wasn't sure how it was going to be, but the guy was so helpful. He explained to me everything. Like, what do you want? And I explained to him, I already have a lot of clothes. Like, you know, I don't need more clothes rack. I need, like, stuff for purses and shoes. So he helped me make this. I want to show you guys. One second, let me sit. Um, so this is going to be for shoes. It can fit, like, up into, I think it's four or three. Depends on my shoe size. And a little space where I'm going to put, like, my coats, blazers. A little space for my pants, like, extra like maybe the i don't know the the my favorite ones or it's not that much space and then like this will be like boxes accessories my purses 
Um, this is see-through. This would be like sunglasses and then like gym clothes, bras, underwear, pajamas. And that's what I needed. So it was very helpful. And now um, they sent somebody through the app, through Ikea, that is going to come and he's going to come here and he's going to um, install for me. Another special delivery today. We have oh, two deliveries. Two deliveries. More, more, almost, 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 more, more. Only three and one. Only three and one. This is so scary. Yeah, baby. Okay, come, come, open your eyes. <laughs> you like it? Try it, sit down. Is it comfortable? See if it's comfortable. There's, there's like trendy. Oh, so comfy. So it's Monday. I'm going to go pick up the, hopefully arrived. The delivery arrived because we paid that. And there were two parts that were going to arrive this week. And I don't know if it's here. So hopefully the piece arrived. So hopefully the piece arrived. I'm going to go pick it up. Because I'm anxious and I cannot wait for them to call me. So hopefully it is here. Oh my gosh. This is such a like dangerous freaking turn. Because like there's no lights. And how am I supposed to go? But yeah. So I'm going to go pick it up. Because... The guy said, once you have all the parts, because they deliver everything but these two missing, they didn't have any of the clear. I'm gonna go like, oh my. Here at Ikea, I'm gonna go pick up the two missing parts because pieces, parts, whatever. It's just like the see-through shelf. They didn't have any in stock last week. So I came to get it. The last two. It's Friday, the guy's coming at 1, so I'm going to go organize the left side of my closet and vacuum and clean so it's ready when he gets here. He can go straight to work, so let's get started. I'm so excited, finally going to see my closet done. So I mean, I clean my closet like every month and it gets messy, so this is so embarrassing, but it's life. Everybody, whatever, I don't care. I just came back from Bali. This is how messy it gets because what happens is I have... The closet on this side, which I won't show too much of. I will show the after when it's done. So the left side is empty. And then usually I place my shoes like this. Usually. Like nice and neatly. But I just came back from Bali. I'm unpacking. And it's just, this is how it gets a lot of times. Because I don't have space. And just I just throw things and whatever. So this area here that is empty will be the new closet. The ikea packs whatever it's called i'm gonna take everything out so the guy has space to work with and i will show you guys the before when it's empty because this is not always this is like when i come back from a trip but it's not usually this messy so i'm just grabbing all my shoes that stay under the closet here because now they're gonna have a space on the new side so i can vacuum real good clean real good here and have nothing on the floor because i will have the new side and this is broken this side is not as pretty because this is not this was from Home Depot or Lowe's. So I'm gonna try to see if I get new drawers. But I'm gonna clean the bottom real good. It gets dusty in here, so I'm gonna take all the shoes out. place for everything there will be no excuse because the secret is you take something and put it back you get home you put the shoes away where it belongs not on the floor not in the hallway i better keep this closet organized and you guys are my witnesses i'm saying i will so i better do i mean people say boxes but saving bags oh lord i just can't throw them away they're too special to me so I took everything out and this is what it looks like. 
the before today's final results but kind of like in the middle because before we had nothing in here this is what usually like it looks like and then i was adding things and things well the mirror is always here but usually it's not that messy and i do clean once a month at least and i have my pants here and i was like i mean i just vacuumed so it's a little bit messy i have shirts t-shirts well like like jackets blazers so the new side i'm going to take all the blazers jackets put it over here because i'm going to have a small section that i'm going to keep all the blazers and jackets and it will give me more space for just regular everyday shirts um well not everyday shirts but like you know like stuff like this everyday shirts is going to be in a drawer and then i only had this space for shoes which i just um the rest that was on the floor i put it outside so the guy has space to work with but i don't know what should i do just high heels on this one and the new one sneakers and flats i don't know how i will separate them but i do have maybe i'll just keep this for sneakers and then this so i'll have the other side i'll put something else i don't know but if you guys want a full tour when it's done like open drawers and explain things i will do please write in the comments and i will do that i need to fix this so this is from like lowe's and we thought it was going to be like stronger better material but we found that was the same thing as ikea but ikea is cuter so i'm not going to invest from you know what's it called um like i didn't want to invest from california closets because it's like a lot of money and i don't know if you know one day we're gonna move or we're gonna build the second floor so why am i gonna invest so much money and you know and then yeah not worth it and for the ikea and this kind of material it will last forever as long as you don't take it out like strong closets you can move take them with you and you're fine this kind of closet as long as you leave it behind you're good to go you just can't take it with you they're not durable to just be taking it out and putting it back together again so in the future if i don't have enough space for hangers i can take this out and this out and have more shirts here not paint not long dresses because of this but i'm gonna ask the guy if he you know i want to put if i put this up for hats just hats and then i can have this up so my dresses don't touch the ground because i hate like i want to have it like this so i can vacuum and stuff and not have it to like dust and whatever but yeah so i'm definitely gonna get this all out of here i'm gonna have more space i don't know what i will do but we'll figure it out and i'll record all the process and i've always had this here my vanity and i want to start buying makeup i don't have a lot of things i have some stuff here and some stuff here that i definitely want to like maybe put some shelves here since i don't have a lot of space like i can't i can't do this on the other side because it's just not a lot of space i don't think it fits because this is not very even but i can just put like shelves like this and keep my makeup on this corner and close to my vanity table and then i have some purses here some stuff here some i took out it's not all here and then i can't wait to show you guys the after when it's all done right, let me try. so this is like what it looks like right now before one last look he the guy's running behind but it's nice and clean and it's ready for the guy to come and work i took everything out so he has space to work and i'll show you guys later i was waiting for the guy i'm done with my closet i was doing other things clean my bathroom he says i'm gonna be here like four o'clock he was supposed to be here at one but then he told me i'm gonna be late so i thought like two now four, I wanted to get my nails done, but it's freaking lunchtime, I'm hungry. I didn't leave, because I thought he was coming out, and I was not coming until later, and I don't have that much time to do my nails and make lunch. Like, he just messed my whole schedule over. But besides that, everything's good. Just waiting for this guy. It is seven o'clock, the guy never showed up, so I went to get my nails done, my birthday nails, and I got my toes, pedicure, and my 
so sad. I had not done my nails since like, like since December, and it's freaking March. Tomorrow's April, so I finally got my nails done, and I'm gonna go buy some stuff at the supermarket. And I'm still waiting for the guy. No show. I'm no show. I'm so sad because I wanted my closet to be done. You know. It would have been nice if it was done today. Then we have like the weekend. My closet would have been nice and neat to start my week Monday and to start my birthday week. Everything good, but no, he just screwed me over. Sfera. So since the guy never came, my husband just ended up bringing his handyman from the company to help us. Getting excited. Definitely didn't think I'm gonna be this big, but Ah, yo tengo. Yo tengo que ahora hacer todo junto. Sí o no? De antes, de parte uno, parte dos. You know, like, I'm going to get the shelves done. Let me see. There's this right here. Okay, and the shelves up here. This is how it's going so far. And then I'm getting, my husband just put this here. My blazer, some pants. So I have some more space because it's already full. All my pants are full. And this is full, so I'm getting my blazers and jackets over there. So I have more space for shirts. He's still in here and I'm already putting things on his way, in his way. I'm already in his way. He's still working. I'm so anxious. I just can't like not start. <laughs> so unfortunately I don't have a video for afterwards because for some reason I thought to myself well I'm one year behind so by the time I catch up I can make a new one but little did I know when I finally caught up to the videos right now as I edit my closet got ruined with the hurricane and I don't have an after video I can't believe I don't have it and like I'm so upset that this happened and now I have to redo my closet all over again and this is why I hate posting one year behind because 
if I was all caught up, you know, last year when the closet was actually done, you guys would have saw it real time. That's why I hate posting one year behind, not actually a year and a half, because this is April from last year. We are already in, what month are we on? Um, October. water came in we had to take all the closets out and right now it's completely empty so this is what my house looks like and I'm hoping soon everything will be fixed and let me know if you guys want to see about the hurricane and hopefully a part two about my closet will be coming soon thank you for watching don't forget to like and subscribe